edition of Out and Hi. This is DeAndre. Welcome to another edition of Talk and Chill on the Commentary. I've gotten more information in regards to Donald Trump uh, fucking ass. Uh, you know, uh, this guy, you know, I mean, I listened to him at Infinitum. He spoke, uh, uh, I don't know if NBC has this sort of demented, <coughs> codependent relationship with him. Because if, there, if there's some false hope that they're gonna that he'll get into the White House and they'll have all this access to him and all of that, but they let him ramble on. I'm, I'm fair. I mean, Mika and both Joe were reading some of the tweets that some of the other candidates were sending them because they're a little offended that they let this motherfucker just go on and on and on. This this Hitlerist dialogue, this fascist sort of fashion show of his ego and bullshit that has nothing to do with solving real problems. This man is escalating the animosity toward the American public. He is endangering our situation. Uh, uh, Barack Obama has repeatedly tried to de-escalate war. He's trying to bring down the drums. Uh, uh, he doesn't want to solo it out with the ability to uh, just shoot it out with anybody just for the fuck of it. Well, you know, it's against the Geneva Convention and a lot of other war tactics this fucking lying ass bastard's mentioning to, to, to bomb it out. You know, and to think that as a humanity, we haven't gone through certain forms of his psychobabbling insanity is ridiculous. And Donald Trump is not referring to how things are done. Uh, Donald, Trump, Donald Trump is referring to the way he wants things to be. And as someone who's never uh, been behind public policy as regards to implementing it from an executive point of view, like a governor or a senator or a mayor or any of those things, he is a businessman. And if you want this motherfucker to do our country the way Wall Street did our country, then you really are trying to do our country. Because this is not like that. This isn't a conventional business in the ordinary sense of things, uh, America. America is a fucking idea based on spirit, unity, and helpfulness. And we try not to be so full of shit out in the open, even though we've done a lot of fucked up things in the back. You know, it's kind of like a mullet. Part, you know, business in the front, party in the back. You know, we have our slavery. You know, we have what we did to the Indians. We have what we did to the to the uh, 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 Japanese and, and, and the different Asian communities during uh, the war. We have our history with uh, our brothers and sisters from south of the border. We, we have a sort of, you know, a moral compass, if you will, on how to try to deal with things. And to have nobody from the GOP, particularly their chairman from the RNC, come out and say, look, Donald Trump is no longer a part of our party, see? Donald Trump is no longer a voice within the system that we are a part of. Donald Trump is a fucking joke. Donald Trump is a hoax. Donald Trump is not real. Donald Trump is a businessman. Donald Trump is a surrogate birth child of the fucking uh, Wall Street lifestyle. Donald Trump is a chump. Donald Trump doesn't have the kind of faith and commitment to this country that it takes to run it. Donald Trump is a racist. Donald Trump is prejudiced. Donald Trump is a, is a, is a homophobic uh, male chauvinist pig. Donald Trump needs a new wig. Donald Trump doesn't have the faith of a fucking twig. Donald Trump is, 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 a, is, a, is a dickwad. Donald Trump is, is an asshole. Donald Trump is a racist. Donald Trump is anti-Muslim. Uh, uh, you know, Donald Trump is disrespectful. Donald Trump is a fucking ass bite. Donald Trump doesn't have any of these issues right. Donald Trump uses his fucking dad's money morning, noon, and night. Donald Trump hasn't done anything constructive to really sociologically flip this country in any positive direction. Donald Trump is a motherfucking asshole. Donald Trump needs to get his kids' life together. Donald Trump is a motherfucking ass bite. I'm sick of him night after night.
his short-sighted racist vision of nothing that needs to really be looked at in the way he's seeing it. This motherfucker is insane. And, 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 and to constantly talk about banning all Muslims and then trying to backpedal on it based on who's going to give him some fucking money about the issue is even more of his tissue. It's bullshit. He's a blowhard. This son of a bitch is a hack. Donald Trump is a fucking hack. He is a hack who wants his money back. He's a liar. He's a shit starter. He ain't going to do nothing. He's a fucking draft dodger. He's a lying-ass racist motherfucker. And he's going around and he's rounding up all these other Ku Klux Klan wannabe sons of bitches. See, white power is being drained hour after hour. And they're hiding behind the fact that, yeah, terrorists do attack. But they attack all over. They attack Israel. Israel attacks Palestine. You know, there's attacks going on in what used to be Yugoslavia. There's attacks from Russia going into Ukraine. There's attacks all up and down Africa again and again. The Mujahideen, all of these things. Uh, uh, violence is the scene. And then you see it on TV with this fighting and all this bullshit. Security guard beating the shit out of that fan the other day. It's just violence. It's violence, it's violence, it's violence. And to have Donald Trump come and act like violence is going to be the answer, it's more of a reality dancer. This guy is a fucking nincompoop. Uh, Donald Trump is a fraud. Donald Trump is very, very sociologically odd. Donald Trump is a part of a death squad. Donald Trump is a mind cough memorizing piece of shit. Donald Trump is not sociologically legit. Donald Trump is full of it. Do not vote for this man. 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 He's a fucking asshole. I don't want him representing our country. He's going to go around and travel around and figure out how to blow him up and get the fucking oil? That's what he's going to do with foreign policy is blow people up and get the fucking oil. You know, he needs to go to Texas and secede and, and go to Texas. Let him be the governor of Texas and give him Texas. And then his motherfucking ass, oh, he's a hypocrite. He got the fucking tower over there in that Muslim country, the country that the religion is primarily Muslim. He, think must, he thinks being a Muslim is a country. He, he's not even aware of the religious aspect of being a Muslim. He don't know what the fuck he's talking about. And who's supporting this son of a bitch? Who supports him? Who's supporting the racist wig-wearing fucker? Who's giving him the money? Who's giving him the fucking money? It's Wall Street. He's a Wall Street war robot son of a bitch. He's a Wall Street fucking rat. He's a rat from Wall Street. He's a big-ass fucking New York rat from Wall Street. Son of a bitch. I can't wait till Hillary Clinton just whoop up in his motherfucking ass. And fuck Fox News. Fuck him.